Shishba Palace, uh, castle, sorry, I keep saying that. And we're gonna climb up there. It's quite a bit of a hike, 140, 150 meters high. And it reminds me of Game of Thrones, man. I wonder if Khaleesi was here. Uh, I wonder if Jason Momoa was here. Um, here on my left, they did some um, excavation and they discovered old uh, civilization. So I'm on top of the uh, Tushpa Castle, um, built 2700 years ago, and by the Urartians. Um, and as we can see, their speciality lied in the, uh, in the canal irrigation system, and this is still active today. Can you imagine 2700 years ago? This is super steep, meaning roughly 120 meters high, if not more. Um, beautifully placed. I'm just feeling dizzy, which is funny. But anyway, so, and this is roughly 1800 kilometers long, um, the castle, the palace. And uh, it's beautiful. Some Urartian kings are also buried here. I'm gonna try to go to that cliff, but it's super, super dangerous because there's no barrier, there's nothing to hold on to. And I wanna sort of live a little bit more. So I'll just see how that goes. But look at the irrigation system, the canal system. They were like the experts and they would build the irrigation system. And that, what you see here, the darker spots, this is an entire civilization, like meaning, the uh, the population used to live here so if you see this this is a minaret as well and here as well so this is an entire you know if we start digging we would probably find a lot of like remains probably body remains as well as like you know bedrooms or rooms or cooking utensils i don't know whatever whatever you can find right and the stairs you can see, I can't go too further, but the stairs you see lead to the dungeons as well. Since this is high on a cliff, I'm sorry, I'm not gonna try to go further up. Look at those people, they're crazy, man. How can they do that? I just die. Anywho, so I'm gonna try to go to the cliffs and see what happens, but I highly doubt it. But look at the view they had, man, that's gorgeous. Oh, beautiful lake. And this is this is the other side of the castle as well, the remaining side. And earlier I said it's 1,800 kilometers long, but no, it's 1,800 meters long. Um, what you can't see here, because I'm not going to go further up, I'm going to try, um, is the way to the dungeon. So, man, I wouldn't like to, you know, die here. But look at that, is this score? Wow. These are the remains of a water well system they had built. Pretty cool. It used to be here as well, but it's just got gotten destroyed over time. So this was a recent discovery. People still don't know what this was. I want to say maybe rooms. Uh, or, I mean, God knows. It could be a kitchen too. Or storage rooms, because they have quite a bit of them. But that's a recent discovery. This is a room made with mud and white um, egg, uh, the white of the eggs. Um, and uh, what's the word? I can think of it in French now. Um, uh, oh, damn it. I'm forgetting it. It'll come back to me. So they use this as a storage room um, for grains or meats or whatever, you know. But that was built by the Ottoman Empire, not the... Uh, not the uh, not 2700 years ago but that dates back to i want to say six to seven hundred years still old for me and look at that i mean it's still standing yeah. so this One is the get... way to go see where the kings are buried uh it's it's uh, it's just quite a steep walk uh quite dirty as you can see but oh wow look at that cool thing uh what is that this is actually, this was their accommodation. Oh, the accommodation, yeah. so we're in yeah. the living quarters. Yeah. Oh man, wow. It has a, how do you call it? Look at that. It has a window. Yeah. Oh wow. Oh, look at that. Anyway, back to the cliff. 
So this is the top of the hill, uh, the cliff, and this wooden, uh, sorry, not wooden, this iron gate is where they would, they would, it's a door actually, where they would uh, slide the bodies down and do something interesting and bury them. And there's no way I'm gonna go down there because it's just madness. Uh, there's no security, there's no railing, nothing of the sort. So anyway, so this is, this is at the top of the hill. Sorry, the castle. Oh my God, I have to go down. I hope I can make it. If we look at those people down there with the sheep and the guys cutting wood. This is the European cuneiform, another way of writing alphabet, I guess. So imagine all of this written 2700 years ago, built, sorry, 2700 years ago. And there's some writing here at the top that says that uh, I am the case, I am the king of this area. Each stone weighs at approximately three ton minimum. And this used to be a huge tower. And he says that by the permission of the god uh, Hilda, uh, Haldi, sorry, I was able to build this. And whoever tries to destroy it, may the wrath uh, of the god Haldi uh, fall upon him. So basically, you know, he cursed anyone who tries to destroy that. So yeah, this used to, so 2,700 years ago, just, just try to imagine how to, how they would have like carved and, you know, carried those stones and then placed them in such an order.